Dr. Robbie Javeri. Thank you so much for joining me here on the Valder BB Show live in Dallas, Texas. I want to let my audience right. know, and you probably already know, it's flu and it's it's uh, flu season here. And are you ready for it, Dr. Javeri? What before we try to avoid getting sick? What is the flu? People talk about it every year, and I don't think most of us know. So, the, th- first of all, thank you for having me. Um, the flu is a respiratory virus that comes every season. Uh, the reason why it comes every season is because it's easier to transmit in cold, dry air. And uh, it changes enough every year that we constantly have to be boosted with a vaccine to protect ourselves. And so as we think about this early part of the year, we have relatively low or minimal levels of flu. But with the upcoming Thanksgiving and winter holidays, we think about travel and people getting together and we worry about the increased spread that usually comes after that. Dr. Ravi, we know you come well qualified to talk about the flu. I'd like to find out from you, how do people avoid getting sick with the flu? So um, we have learned well about the common sense measures that we can take in this post-pandemic year. So certainly uh, washing your hands, wearing a mask, staying away from others uh, when they're sick or when you're sick, but also knowing that there is a flu vaccine that is highly effective and is really our best way to protect ourselves as well. Who should get the flu vaccine? Is there an age group or an age limit? So um, the... There is a flu vaccine that's recommended for everyone six months of age and older. And so regardless of what your medical history is or what your background is, everyone can get a flu vaccine. There are multiple options uh, to, uh, to choose from. Can we prevent the flu? Uh, we can prevent the flu as best we can with flu vaccine and by protecting ourselves. There's nothing that's 100 percent. But. Uh, there are many options to choose from, and including a needle-free version. And so I'm partnering with AstraZeneca today to raise awareness about this option. It's called Flumis Quadrivalent, and it's the first and only nasal spray flu vaccine that's FDA-approved uh, for people 2 to 49 years of age. Are there any other options for the flu vaccine? So there are injectable flu versions, uh, uh, many different types. And so, again, depending on your age, and um, your medical history, you should uh, encourage everyone to speak to their health care provider to determine which option is best for them. Okay, let's talk about age. Let's talk about those 65 and over. That's my audience. Are there any okay. uh, special chance, uh, things they need to be aware of? Yeah, so when you look at the CDC guidance, so first of all, um, there are some different options that are specifically designed for older adults. Their immune systems need a little extra boost in order to respond to the flu vaccine. And so um, in particular, they should talk with their doctors or with their pharmacist about the options that are particular for them. And what about uh, small children? So uh, Children, certainly we know they're at increased risk. Schools and daycares are uh, uh, important settings where flu gets easily transmitted. And so I often talk to my uh, uh, the parents of my patients about practicing the good hand hygiene we talked about, but also emphasizing having them uh, get that flu vaccine, uh, whether it's a needle-free option we're discussing or the injectable version too. What would you like my audience to take away? Because... I had on my social media page, I'd be talking to you, and people were saying, oh, I'm not worried about the cold and flu season because the season just started and things look like they're going to be okay, but you never know until you get into something. So what tips do you have for people who are thinking like that? Well, certainly what I would say is the best time to prepare is before the season really gets bad. And as we think about our your pre-holiday planning, this is a great time to Again, touch base with your healthcare provider. Uh, you can visit findflumis.com for more information. But certainly getting it done now versus waiting until the flu season is much more active is a, is a much better strategy. Doctor, I want to thank you so very much for stopping by the Valder BB Show. I'm sure I'll be talking to you again as the cold and flu Sounds season good. comes upon us. Have a great day. You too. Thanks for having me.
Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, host of The Valder Beebe Show. We have over 1,000 videos on ValderBeebeShow.com and YouTube.com slash Show. We upload new videos daily. Our site is a modern baby boomer platform with news and information important to boomers. Subscribe to YouTube.com slash Show and stay connected as I interview the world's most fascinating people.